Okay. I don't know if you can hear it, but, oh, by the way, for those of you who want to see the nose ring better, um, it's covered in makeup. Somebody likes to tell me how you not cover this in the makeup spot. Wait, okay, could you hear the screaming? The screaming that's going on out there right now? Okay, so it's coming this way. Okay, Hearn came home and found out that Jean Jean had eaten all the honey puffs. Cocoa Army honey puffs, the, you know, the honey puffs. I don't know, I don't eat that cereal. It's a raisin bread. Anyway. So, he's out there screaming to call 911, and we, were, we hid the phones because Jean Jean ate all the honey puffs and stole them from him. So now we have to call the police and report it. Now, I just taught him about 911. Didn't mean to call on his brother to report him for eating something that is out there for everyone. The cereal is sort of on a first come, first serve basis. Um, unfortunately, they're all in this huge growth spurt right now, and I can't keep them fed. If we didn't have an Aldi up the street, you know, to supplement the inexpensive Myers stuff that we get, and and now, actually, we're actually considering a membership to Costco so that we can buy foods in bulk so that we can keep everyone in the house fed. But, like I said, he's out there trying to find a phone to call 911 to call the police. Oh, no, he wants Dad to call the police on Gigi. Um, over Honey Puffs. I know when you're like six years old and autistic, this is a huge issue. We've got like popcorn, we've got light fruit and cans, we've got oranges and apples, we've got haagen ice cream, but they don't know about it because it's mine. We hit it. Oh, wait, okay, now he wants Gigi to be grounded, and now he's grounding my husband or not grounding Gigi. I'm sorry if I find this all amusing, because if I, if I was not the center of the storm like my husband was, I'd be like up a wall right now, but I'm thinking about going and taking a bath. 